And welcome back to Ozarks Live. We have a lot to talk about today, but first we're going to start in my favorite spot, the kitchen, with Chef Aaron Brooks today from Wind Sweat Farms. Aaron, how are you? Wonderful. Thank you for having Good. me. Good. Well, I'm wonderful too because you're here. There's a big event coming up this weekend, and it is called Beer and Burger Wars. 417 Beer and Burger Wars. Yes. What's not to love about that? So, who's are you're part of this? Con this is a competition. Yes, I am one of the competitors. Okay, so ha have, have you done a competition like this before? I have. I was in a local Iron Chef competition at the farmers market. Okay, but you have to have a lot of faith in your burger to get in this particular competition. Yes. Yes, I'm, okay. I'm pretty confident. Okay, I asked him. He's going to make us a burger real quick here, but this is not the recipe you're going to enter in the contest because you're not going to give away your secrets. Right. I held a tasting this last weekend uh -huh. and made eight different burgers, all my own recipe. This was actually the number two burger. Uh, the one I'm going to do at the competition edged this one out by about a quarter of a point. Okay, well, let me just say for the record, if you ever need a taster, you let me know for sure. All right, so now if you... If you go to this event, and here in a minute, Tom's going to tell you more about the intricacies of the event and where it's going to be held and all of that. But if you win here, where do you go? From here, I'll go to Dallas to participate in the World Food Championships. The World Food Championships? Yes. Uh, I'll be competing against roughly 1,500 other chefs. My goodness. Okay. So depending on if you win here, then you will take your recipe there, and you could literally be the world champ, the yes. world burger champ. I mean, are we pulling for the sky or what? This is exciting to me. I really is. Okay, so you've got a burger on the stove here. Yes. And I want you to tell me what you think of in terms of doing to make a perfect burger. What uh, are you going to make for us today? Today is one of my specialties, uh, one of my favorites. Um, I love it. The topping is a bone marrow and blue cheese butter. Mm. Um, and the burger itself is infused with roasted garlic and shallots and fresh herbs. And it's made from locally sourced um, Irish Dexter gourmet beef. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. So it, it, it sounds kind of intricate, but honestly, the simplicity of it sounds to me like it's not over the top difficult. You want to plate one up and show me how you do it? I see it Absolutely. looks like you've got some rosemary here. I want to know what all you're going to do. Well, we'll start with the burger. Okay, so this is your blue cheese. Yep, bone marrow and blue cheese butter. Bone marrow. And we, blue I roast the bones to get the marrow out and fold it in with some butter, some blue cheese, some fresh herbs. We garnish a little bit of rosemary just to make it pretty. And a little extra blue cheese. Extra blue cheese is always a good thing. Yeah, you can never, ever have too much cheese. Like I said, I mean, this is just gorgeous. And I mean, I love blue cheese. So this is just the kind of thing that I would absolutely love to try. And I am going to try it here in just a minute. By the way, good luck to you. Thank you. I can't wait to see how it goes this weekend. And we're going to pitch it now to Tom over on the set to talk a little bit more about when this is going to be held and where and how you can be a part of it. Tom? Absolutely. We'll give you the nuts and bolts about everything. I'm here with Greg Sullivan. President of Kiwanis, Yana Marino from WeDames.com, and Michelle Higgins from Ozarks Barbecue. So that's Greg, Yana, and Michelle. Okay. Now you guys are going to talk about this whole. Give us the nuts and bolts of when and where this is all going to be taking place. Who wants to jump in on that? I can jump in. So right. the VIP dinner is going to be uh, the 12th. So that's this Friday. It starts mm -hmm. at 6 p.m. It's going to be at Moontown Crossing. That's the Barley House, uh, 3060 North Kentwood, uh, North Macadoodles. Yes. Yeah. Now, of course, it is the competition, but there's a lot that's going to be going on during the evening, right? Yes. We have a celebrity chef that is joining us, Craig Baker, and we are going to have a fabulous dinner. And we have our local chefs that are competing. They will be showing up, and we have great entertainment, wonderful food. So you need to be there at and the as, VIP. And as we said earlier, it's for a good cause. Tell me about that good cause. So that good cause is Mr. Nick's Playground. And for anybody who doesn't know, Nick Hossler was a, an Olympic hopeful. He was an MSU cheerleader, was teaching. He was a special ed teacher at McBride. And he passed away suddenly and unexpectedly. Mm -hmm. And his parents had looked for, how do we honor Nick's memory? So they're raising money to build an all-inclusive playground. Playground where a kid in a chair can literally roll onto the merry-go-round. Yes. Where, where a parent who is mobility impaired or grandparent can actually go to the playground with the kid. Yeah. And it's going to be in that McBride Park. And so we're the, the 
fundraising portion on Friday, those proceeds are going uh, to Mr. Nick's playground. And it's amazing because some people don't realize grass, you would think it's innocent. Try going through it with a walker or crutches or a wheelchair. That's what this is all about, to change that dynamic. Absolutely. And then, and then playground equipment that's designed so that anybody with any amount of mobility or with lack of mobility can, can use it and enjoy it. So that kids from all spectrums of mobility can play together on a playground. And that's the most important part about this whole thing, but tell folks again when and where it's going to be and how they can get more information. Okay, well, again, uh, the 12th, that's this Friday, it's going to be at Moontown Crossing, the Barley House. That's the VIP dinner. And then the main event is going to be Saturday, so that's the 13th, that's the next day, right. also at the same venue, so 3060 North Kentwood. And if people want more information, Facebook, website, things like that? Yeah, you can go to 417bbw.com. Pretty simple. Yes. 417 Burger and Beer Wars. It's happening this weekend. Great cause, great cause. Thank you all for being here with us today. Thank you, Chef. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, up next, we have some guys who know a thing or two about cars, especially when it comes to racing them. Is a burger coming our way? Yeah. Ozarks Live will be back faster than you can say hamburgers and Lucas Oil five times fast.